Good morning, welcome back to our channel. Welcome back to our life in Holland. It's a beautiful Saturday morning. Ava and I are up early this morning because Ava is headed to her very first teen dance audition. She's being really brave. She is going to audition by herself, meaning she will not know anyone there. Super proud of her for being so brave. She loves dance. Ava is a beautiful dancer, and we talked about what she wants to do next year, and she decided on her own that she would like to try out for a dance team audition. So she is trying out at the place where she already does dance, and one other place. And then we'll go from there and decide what she's gonna do for next year. So everybody wish Ava some good luck. You're gonna be so awesome. Go show them what a good dancer you are. All right, Ava just finished her dance auditions. Ava, tell us everything. How did it go? <laughs> what did you have to do? Mm. Lots of, stuff. Lots of stuff. Like I curled up to a ball and then I did split the splits. You showed them the splits. That's your secret move. And kite. Yeah. And back then. Was it so fun? Mm -hmm. Ava did so awesome. I'm so proud of her. Now we are home. The boys are all working on the yard, so we're gonna go help them with that. We're gonna do a little birthday planning because next weekend somebody's turning six. And we've got lots of fun things coming. A lot of things coming our way. <laughs> We got a busy Saturday birthday party for the twins. Second game of State Cup for Turin. Justin and I have a birthday dinner this evening. So come along with us for all the fun today. Just got home and the boys are going to town on this backyard. They spent a ton of time last week Saturday actually in the yard doing a ton of weeding. But today they're full on ripping out dead trees, pulling out tons and tons of grass that's growing in the wrong places, more weeds. Sweetie, you've never been better looking. Thank you, Dan. <laughs> this man's work over here. <laughs> Okay, is it true that you really used the truck to pull out one of these trees over here? Turns got through. Did he video it? Oh yeah. So this used to be right here. It was completely dead. So let's cut to that clip right now. Check out these boys working hard over here. I think that shovel's taller than you, Ash. Yes, it is. That's why I'm having a hard time using it. <laughs> you dad, 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 dad. <laughs> Let's see that thing up close. Oh my gosh, if you put that in your mouth. <laughs> that is so gross. That guy was hiding under that dead tree. All right, y'all, we are headed to Big Mac Monday's birthday party. The twins here have been invited. And then little Miss Ava has also been invited to hang out. So we're going up to the grandpa's house today. They've got a sick pool. We've got birthday gifts in tow. Turin and mom are actually headed to Turin's soccer game. We're not sure if he's gonna play. We're fingers crossing, isn't that right guys, that he's gonna play. But TBD on that. So divide and conquering today, which is a typical Saturday in the day in the life of the Bingham family. So anyway, we're gonna bring you guys along with us to a pretty epic birthday party party with a pretty epic pool and some good times. So come join us. Hope you guys are enjoying your Saturday. By the time you're watching this video, likely to be some time during the week. So I'm hoping you're enjoying whatever day you are on today. We hope you're enjoying that day. Big Mackey! Oh, 
While Justin and the other kids are at the birthday party, I brought up Turin for game two of the State Cup. Unfortunately, not looking like he's going to play from what seemed like a super minor injury that he just have to stay off of for a few days, lasting longer than we'd like. So we're gonna take him into the doctor early next week, find out if anything more serious is going on or if he's just growing. We've been talking to some friends about Ashton Slaughter disease. I don't know if I'm saying that right. So we're gonna go take him in, see what's going on. In the meantime, we're gonna cheer on his team today and hope that he gets feeling better in time to play in future games next week. celebrating our good friend Chris's birthday tonight, but I wanted to give you guys an update post game. Turin indeed did not play just like I had predicted, so I'll keep you posted on how his knee is doing and everything that happens with that early next week. His team won 7-0, so they are going into the quarterfinals with an advantage. They're gonna be playing a second place team. There's four brackets in the first place spot, playing a second place team in another bracket. So they have the advantage going into the quarterfinals, so stay tuned for that on Monday as well. At the party, the Twins and Ava got a pretty cool experience. So did I, actually. The heavyweight champion of the world, Andy Ruiz, actually showed up to the house, which is pretty cool. Now, I am not like a big, knowledgeable person of boxing, but I certainly knew who he was. Anyway, this guy shows up. He's like 6'1", the kindest, most humble, soft-spoken, guy but man you do not want to get behind his fist that's for sure so it was kind of fun to watch him uh, they had this little punching bag machine where he would punch it and it would give you the big numbers and anyway, it was kind of fun to watch him do that and the kids were all running around being like whoa this guy's awesome anyway so that was pretty cool hanging out with Andy Ruiz so you guys thanks for hanging out with us today if you have not already make sure you subscribe we are 600 followers away from a hundred thousand we are on the countdown Maybe we should do like a paper chain or something at our house. <laughs> so if you haven't subscribed, make paper, sure that you do. 600 paper chain. Yeah, 600, I think. Make sure you smash the like button and we will see you guys tomorrow.